everyone. Welcome to our channel, Rebecca, Stu, and the crew. I'm Rebecca, and today we have a Dollar Tree video for you guys to show what's new this week at the Dollar Tree. I went to five Dollar Trees in DFW, and this will be for the week of May 7th, 2022. I apologize. The videos have not been on a regular schedule the last few weeks. My daughter's getting married next weekend. We have a bunch of guests coming in from out of town. We're so busy getting those last few minute things done, so thank you for your understanding. And we'll be back at a regular schedule soon. So let's go shopping. We're going to go to apparel and accessories first. This week they had some new tote bags made out of recycled materials. So if there are two colors like yellow and black, then the handles are also two colors. You'll get like a two-toned uh, black and yellow. This one has the brown with the red handles. Some had blue. And then they also had their um, summertime bags out with like the lemons, the palms. They had a blue one with a bunch of different seashells on them. And then the pink one with the hibiscus flowers. They also had their waterproof extra large bags. And these have like a mandala on the front. A blue one that says smile, shine bright, and be kind. The gray one here that says she is a dreamer, a doer, a thinker. She sees possibility. And then the orange one that says all I want is coffee and my dog. Then they had some cosmetic bags that were like a plastic see-through that say beach in the bright orange, pink, and green. And they had the canvas cosmetic bags with the leather accents, some new shoelaces by uh, Kiwi style in the bright orange and yellow. They are 45 inches long. They had some I Do Crew jewelry, a whole bunch of different necklaces. Um, you can get them with either the silver or the gold. So they had the rhinestone necklace and earring set. You could also get it with the gold chain. Here are the earrings to match. And they had this large uh, kind of like teardrop diamond shaped one as gold on the back. They had the um, necklace that looks kind of like a flower and they had matching earrings for that one. On the blue cards here, they've got the heart with the flower. It says, thank you for being by my side and the gold and silver. And then earrings to match those. It has like a double heart and a flower gold and then they had some of their resin earrings then they brought back these small cards of earrings that say like you're beautiful with the crosses and either gold or silver that says I love you they had the hearts that say love you and then the French knots and rhinestones Quite a few different bits of jewelry. I also found these zipper pouches with the zodiac signs. Um, it kind of has like a holographic look on the front. And then it has a drawing of all the zodiac signs in this dark navy blue with the stars on the front. And it does have a zipper at the top. And they're about a four by six inch uh, size zipper pouch. I saw two boxes of them sitting on the shelf and they were more over by like where you would find um, like the hair bows and like headbands, uh, hairbrushes, things like that uh, for these. And I found these at three of the five stores that I went to this week. And then to go along with the zipper pouches, they also had the eye mask. Uh, they are in black and then it's got the zodiac sign written in gold on the front and it also has the stars with the little lines that connect each one of the zodiac signs so you can see the mapping of the stars so for the eye mask i found those over by like the feminine products and deodorant and they were hanging on those little plastic strips that you see hanging from the racks in the aisle They had quite a bit. I think they had just got these in the day before because there were quite a few left. Over in Arts and Crafts this week, they had some new stickers. I love these large stickers with the cupcakes and they had like unicorn donuts, which were so cute. A nice large sticker. You could also get the rainbow hearts or just the rainbows. 
and they have glitter on them as well. They had some sticker booklets. They had the Lisa Frank stickers. You get 600 in that book. There's five sheets. Also, the Dr. Seuss stickers. You get 400. They had the pop-up stickers by the Jot brand. They had a bunch with the um, different seashells on it. Uh, some foods, which are really cute. And then some with different sayings like, oh my God, stay wild, girl power, rainbows. A bunch of like bright colors, which are really cute. And they're all like a 3D effect with the pop-up pieces um, so that you can see, you know, kind of like that 3D effect there. Some more of the nautical beach type stickers. Now these were not over by the shore living items. They were over just in the sticker section. So that's why I chose to put these in with the arts and crafts items because that's where I found them. We had some of the Momoko um, scented stickers. So you get 117 stickers and they're the scratch and sniffs. They had pizza, bubble gum, jelly beans, and then the last one, I think, was the chocolate. And they're so cute. They look like s'mores. That really brought back memories from when I was a kid with the scratch and stiff, sniff stickers. They have the rhinestone sticker crowns back in. And the gold with the little rhinestones on them. And these extra large stickers. <sighs> They have the puffy sticker cat, rainbow, a guitar, and a donut. Then they had their two count pack of the roses that are the um, tea light candles. They're battery operated. They had them in purple, white, and pink, and it says it has a flickering light. Also, the color changing lights with the ice crystals that you can put in. And it says that they are good in like water. So you could put them um, submerged in water. They had out their um, beaded garland. This is from Valentine's Day. But they had these at two of the stores I went to this week. So I don't know if they're just like a late arrival or what. But they do have out the pink, purple, white, and red. And that is the berry garland from Valentine's Day. Some of the metal cone wreaths are the 18 inch. They look like tomato cages. They had quite a few of those out. And then this new um, ribbon. I showed you guys the off-white last week. This week I found it in four different colors. They have it in white, a little bit darker tan, green, and then brown. And here's what it looks like opened up. Also the gemstone ribbon they brought that back in it's got the rainbow color gemstones and then the floral burlap trim you get three uh different designs in the package here's a close-up so you guys could see the trim then i found these laser cut words you get two in each pack they had one that said love family home and blessed also, they had these large chalkboard or the DIY wood signs. They had apples. It already has the hanger attached, which was nice. So they have these apples. You can get a coffee cup or like a latte. They'd be cute on a coffee bar. And then they had the house. Also, they had the dry erase uh, chalkboard and dry erase boards in the white. They had just like a regular square and then the hexagon. I was really happy to see that they brought back the extra large circle DIY signs. Those go really fast and they don't carry them all that often. And then up in the front by the Mother's Day items, they brought back these boxes and they come in three different sizes. They're all the same price, whether you get the small one or the large one, they're $1.25 each. And here's just a close-up so you guys can see the difference in the sizes. Also in the crafter score section, they had these new rainbow macrame kits, which I thought was really neat. Has everything you need inside to make this rainbow. And then they had the macrame kit where you would do the weaving. And then they had some of their scented brooms. They had pumpkin spice and eucalyptus. And these are good to craft with.
And now for the baby items, not a whole lot new this week, but they did have these really cute Mickey Mouse signs and they are the month milestone markers, which I thought was really cool. So you could lay the baby down and put the little milestone marker next to them or put it on their shirt and take a picture for like a scrapbook and it shows the baby growth throughout the first year. And here's all the different stickers you can see on the back. And now over in the health and beauty, we'll start with cosmetics as we usually do. So they brought back the beauty blender cases that look like fruit. They had these out around Christmas time. So you could get the um, pineapple, strawberry, and the pear. And those are the Sassy Chic brand. Also the lashes, you could get the um, extensions, which are just the short wispies or the full um, lashes and they had a lot of the really like dramatic extra thick extra long lashes this week um, and then they also had in a bunch of these really cute LA Colors uh, nails to the press on nail tips so you could either get the color flare you get 12 pieces of the different colors or they have these geometric designs so they have like this yellow with the white lines on it they had the white and pink and then this one in different like coffin shapes. So it's got the tan with the white on the edges, pink with a gold X. And then the white with the orange stripes. And those are the geometric nails. They were in this pop-up cardboard box in the cosmetics aisle. They also had their new um, toenail extensions. So uh, they had really cute summer designs like palm trees and stuff on them. It does not include the glue, but I've never seen the, at least I don't remember ever seeing the toenail uh, fashion tips. So that was kind of neat to see those. I also had these new nail polish applicators that come in two different colors. It's just like a soft um, rubberized kind of type material. And I guess you put the handle to the um, nail polish up inside and it helps you hold it to paint your nails there's also these hydrating lipstick balm that's like a clear balm i believe and it comes in three different scents it has this really pretty uh floral uh container and there's like lavender rose and that is the be pure brand and those are up by the mother's day items as well the packaging is just so pretty over in hair care this week. Last week I showed you guys, they had this large um, gold, it kind of looks like a chain barrette. And then um, this week I found basically the same barrette, but they had two more. They had one that was in like the brown and black and then this pearl white. Also last week I showed you guys the cheetah and like kind of like, it's almost like a deer uh, type of material, like the, um, material that they have they had these elastic bands this week and also some snap clips to match the set so they had like scrunchies headbands scrunchies with the ribbons last week so they added a few more to the set so i wanted you guys to see those also then they had these headbands that were the cat ears with the pearls at the top and they come in a soft pastel pink or off-white They had some matching ribbon uh, barrettes here with the pearls in the center. Or you could also get the fluffy headbands that's covered in the fur with pearls. And they had those also in the pink and white. You can get the matching scrunchie to go with those. Those also have the pearls attached to the scrunchie. Or some snap-on clips. They had those in pink, purple, and off-white. Then they had the multi-purpose satin scarf. They had a whole bunch of different colors and designs for protective hairstyles. So I thought that was nice that they finally had started to carry the silk scarves. I know those are very important in a lot of um, hair protective styles. They had lots of different designs to choose from. Then they found this gorgeous barrette with the daisies. So cute. It's got like this gold um, alligator clip with the metal daisies attached. So cute for summertime. Over in the pharmacy and personal care this week, there were um, these new loofahs in the darker colors. 
They had the exfoliating bath gloves to match. Also some manicure kits. These were over by the Mother's Day items with the flowers. They had some matching eye masks to match these we showed last week. And they had these loofahs that have a um, rope on both sides. So you could open them up and use them to clean like your back. And they open up really wide, probably about like 12 inches. They had them in pink and in blue with the white center. You can get the um, Bolero Facial Lavender Chamomile Cleaner. They had some different hydrating like facial serums, rose hip. Also, these pocket cologne. These are so cool. I actually bought some of these. So you just flip the little top up and then it has a pump so you can spray cologne and it fits in a shirt pocket. They had this Derma Antiperspirant Secret Lotion where you could use pretty much anywhere. It says it matches all skin tones. Over in the Fun Finds this week, they had some um, Color Mates. Uh, it's like a lip balm and it's got this little poppet sensory toy attached as a keychain on the side. They had two different scents of those. These small sticky note notebooks has a whole bunch of like post-it notes in it and list pads. They had quite a few. So this one has all the different pink and green color notepads. And then the last one here is this one with all the different kind of fall color flowers on the outside. And then there are all the little notepads on the inside. Also, the sequined pen and pencil pouches that look like mermaid tails in pink and in blue. And they are a real soft uh, material on the back. Also, these water games, you just push the button and try to get the hoops onto like the fish or some coral. And they're just a little uh, game a handheld game some extra large bugs these were kind of fun uh they're really big they fit in the palm of my hand but they go probably about four or five inches they're pretty big depending on which one you get they're even bigger than that so over in home decor this week quite a few new items they had a bunch of the stretched canvas pictures in the dark navy blue with different like green and soft pink colors to match they also had like shiplap looking pictures just a whole bunch of different ones really modern looking and these were all the eight by eight sizes they had some tea light candle holders that look like swans these were up towards the front of the store and the few that i found them at they had a whole bunch of them also some trinket trays that have different sayings on them for mother's day they have all you need is love and grandma and these are all heart shaped they have the you put the great in grandma for great grandmas. Grandmas are the greatest blessings. Love you, mom. And they had this one that says home is where mom is. Then they had these prayer jars. They had something similar around Christmas time. They look like houses. Now they have just these little jars. It says say your prayers, count your blessings, and then... um give thanks and be grateful and there's like little cards inside that you can fill out and put inside the jar to keep also these cactus stands that say welcome there are two different versions that you could get they have like some metal accent on them with the wood backing they had some more of the be happy lanterns And I like the lights. It has an on-off switch that you turn. Also, the large plastic love signs in the black and gold. Then they had these metal wall uh, decor. They're just these extra large flowers. They had them in peach, blue, a soft pink, and off-white. They all have these little hangers at the top with some weathered kind of like antiquing accents around the outside of the flower petals. Here's a view of the back. They also had these wood uh, plaques here. There's two of them. I showed you guys these last week. I found that I'm at them at a few more stores this week. And then the love signs with the wreaths for the O. They had those back this week as well. I also found these really pretty candle votives with the flowers painted on the outside. There's a few different ones that you can get. I believe there's three floral ones with the um, just regular candle votives. There's three or four. But then they also had these jars 
um, that have like the smaller neck at the top and it's got a piece of twine tied around the top and there were a few different floral patterns in those as well. They're too small to get a candle in them so they're just either for decoration or flowers. Also they had these large jars in the green, purple, and white. And then these large lanterns that already have the nautical rope attached to the top. I found them in green and in white, and they're quite large. Also, the house shadow boxes that they carry a few times a year, they have these back in as well, and they come in three different sizes with a bunch of different prints on the background. If you don't like the background, they're very easily changed. They had these 3D signs that say hello, family, and gather. And now we'll go see what's new in housewares, home organization, and electronics. They had their uh, battery powered lights back in, these little hanging lamps, some new trash bins. They had them in gray, navy blue, white, and black. So these are round. These are new. Usually they just have the um, rectangular kind of style. They had a bunch of CDs. They had some for like meditating, motion picture soundtracks. They also had um, like different comedy specials and then collective music like the best of boy bands. A bunch of these earbud containers that you can use with the zipper pouch and it's got a pouch on the inside that you can store different like electronic pieces a whole bunch of different ones with like summertime fruits so they have the earbud pouches to match the um little handles that you can put on your phone they're kind of like a pop socket they had limes strawberries they also had pineapples and watermelon and then peach they're really really cute i love that the um, pop sockets kind of have a 3D effect to them. So they have like little raised up pieces made out of like a rubberized material to make it look more realistic. And then some of them, you can also get a phone case to match. You just have to read on the front to see what phone it would fit. Here's the peach. They're so cute. They also have some tropical items with like the hibiscus flowers. And this one was a square um, earbud pouch. They have the pop socket to match. This was the pink and green palm tree type design and then some flamingos. We also had some new uh, bins with the snap-on lids. You could get them in the peach, dark navy blue, and the seafoam green. And these are larger than the white ones that they usually carry. Over in the kitchen and pantry this week, they had these new canister jars, which are a nice large size. The snap clip on the side is really nice. It makes a nice tight seal on the jar. They had quite a bit of those, and I found them at all five stores that I went to this week. They also had this extra large jar here, so I'm going to show you guys a comparison size next to the size jars that are similar that they usually carry. They also had some new butter containers in red, white, and blue with the snap-on lids. These are plastic. Also the um, ice cube containers with the snap-on lids with the little lift up um, flap that you can pour the water through and the water bottles and the pink and gray. These are not dishwasher safe. Also some new coffee mugs. This one says coffee break. They have one that just says cafe and then must have coffee. And these are really pretty with the white and the black very modern looking. Also these um, Copco uh, reusable coffee cups in purple. It's got this little movable top so you can open and close the mouthpiece so it doesn't spill. And then they had some new kitchen plates that say be happy with the bees and flowers on them. So these are just the smaller size plates. I didn't see any dinner plates. These are just the smaller sizes. They had a whole bunch of them however and they did have um, the bowls. These are all ceramic with the bees and flowers on the side. They had a bunch of those. Also the coffee mugs to match. There's a close up so you guys can see the pictures really well. So those are all the coffee cups. They had the um, stemless water glasses or stemless wine glasses 
and then the regular water glasses, which are just the tall, wa clear water glasses. And here's all the pictures. You guys can see those. Those are the tall glasses. And then the short one that says, be happy. Just wanted you guys to be able to see all the pictures and the close-ups of those. So really, really pretty. Over in the office supplies, home library and teaching tree, not a whole lot new. They had these expandable file folders for like coupons and things and the soft pastel colors, blue, pink, mint, green, and purple. They brought back these um, glass pens with the ink. I love these, they're so fun. The pen has like grooves in it. So when you dip it in the ink, it holds on to it. And then you can write on that paper. We reviewed those about a year ago on our channel. They work really well. Also the Sharpie gem, like Mystic gem markers. They had a bunch of those also. Then for party supplies, I found these beautiful trays in the white with the scalloped edges. It's to hold like cupcakes and snacks and different things. I just thought these were really pretty. There's a decent sized serving tray. Here's a view from the top. And then the stickers, you guys could see up close what it looks like here with it uh, displayed. They had some gift boxes for Father's Day that look like a briefcase, a fishing tackle box. They had the cooler and the toolbox. They've had these out the last few years, probably the last five years. So nothing new there, but they are in stock now. For pet care, the only thing they had this week was they had restocked the... Um, food mats that look like a dog bone or a cat head. And these are really fun to use Cricut iron on vinyl with just an FYI. Over in the toys, games, and entertainment, they had these bubble frisbees. These are so cute. So you just throw them. It's got all these little holes. Once you dip them in the uh, bubble solution, they have bubbles everywhere. They had some new squishies in that look like these little cakes. I love the unicorn. I think that's probably my favorite one. There's four in all. They're a nice, large, squishy, but they are not slow rise. They actually rise pretty quickly and they are scented. But they're a nice, large, squishy for $1.25. Now for the shore living, which is the new section Dollar Tree's had out the last few weeks. They have these small mason jars with the twine and tiny starfish to decorate the outside. You can get them in the clear the teal or the dark navy blue. They also had these larger lanterns with the metal handles and they have a tiny rope and a wooden uh, embellishment on the front. You can get the larger lanterns that just look like pebbles on the outside. Now these are not as big as the ones I showed you in the home decor, but they are bigger than um, the ones that I just showed you with the fish on them. Then they had some of the metal yard stakes. So they had these fish and the off-white with the gemstone eyes. It has a, like a starfish and a clamshell down on the stick part. You could also get it in this really pretty blue. It's like a blue-gray kind of color. They had a sailboat. And then the oar, it says coast with the arrow. Also one that says Ahoy with the anchor. Some small signs that say life is better at the lake. Here's a view of the back so you guys can see what the hanger looks like. They're about a five by seven size. Happiness is easy at the beach. You and me in the sea. Also these plaques have little hooks on them so you could hang them on the wall. There are three different ones that I found. They all have a different picture on them, but all the same color scheme. And here's a view of the back so you guys can see the hanger, how you would hang those. They also had their beads in again this week. This one has the wheel to the ship and some starfish embellishments. Also these large signs that say relax with the faux metal and the sea star that says welcome. I also found these large vertical signs that say relax and home. So the O for the home is like the large seashell. And then the relax, the A at the bottom is a um, sailboat. They also had a bunch of straws with the paper straws with the nautical theme. They had a couple different packs of those. And then their stretched canvas pictures. They had a whole bunch of boxes of the stretched canvas pictures up in the front. They had the blue and white color scheme with all the different seascape pictures. 
they had like seagulls, they had um, a bunch of the ocean, some sailboats, they had the grassy sand up on the shoreline, the beach chairs. So there's quite a few. They're really nice. And like I said, they are the eight by eight inch size stretched canvas pictures. At least the ones I found were. Just one more here. They have the whale. Also, they had some more of the little wooden pieces. They had uh, sea turtles, some of the shore living paintbrushes. These are the same that are over in the crafting aisle. They just have a white handle and then they've got the blue paint palette. Over in the seasonal items this week, they had a few new things that kind of separated it from the shore living. So they brought back these welcome signs with the red and blue truck. This one says, God bless America. These are like a door hanger. They also had their bunting with the three metal grommets at the top. It's made out of like a polyester style material. So they are waterproof. They had some small miniature pails with the gnomes with their fireworks. Or you can get the small pail that looks like the American flag. And then they have a white one with different stars and fireworks on the outside. Then they had some new yard signs with the um, gnomes that have the USA type theme. So this isn't cardboard. It's not that particle board. It's kind of like the signs you would use for your yard for like campaign signs. It's a style material they're made out of. Also, they had some patriotic hats and then a ton of Mother's Day balloons for tomorrow, which is Mother's Day and graduation balloons. For the graduation section, they also had the rubber duckies. It's a class of 2022 with the graduation caps they had some new 3d signs that look kind of like um blown up balloons that say congratulations grad and they come in silver and gold those would work really well on a cake also some summer signs that say hello summer and welcome with the gnomes all wearing their sunglasses and summer hats and then for the Dollar Tree Plus items, which are the three to five dollar items, they brought back these planters. They are five dollars each. These large wreaths, those are also five dollars. And then they had these three dollar roommates wall decor. It says do. It's a chalkboard um, sign that you can hang on the wall that you can write on. And it's just the two decals and it shows you um, how to put it up and stuff on the back of the packaging those were three dollars for five dollars they had these large bird houses restock their diy so you can paint them also some summer party uh style games they had disc golf for the yard for five and the three by three checkers also some sandals they had the black with the rhinestones on the straps you could also get them in white they have them in quite a few different sizes from small all the way up to like, I think it's a size 10 in women's. They also had the faux kind of like rubberized Birkenstocks. You know, they're a generic off brand and white and black some beach towels for $5 or a nice full size beach towel. They're, I believe 28 by like 58 inches. They're pretty big. I found a few different ones this week. And then these large throw pillows for $5. They had them in gray, white, and then it's kind of hard to tell what color this is, but it is peach. And that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I am trying to get back to a regular schedule as soon as this wedding is over. I do apologize. I'm just so busy. There just is not enough hours in a day to get this all done. So I apologize, but I'm happy to at least get it up, you know, these videos up even if a day late. I'm posting the DIY video today as well. I made this faux wood wall sign. And of course, we do the Dollar Tree videos every single Friday. Thank you guys so much for watching and being patient with me. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And I'll see you guys next week. Have a wonderful week and a wonderful Mother's Day if you celebrate.